This year, Woodlawn students were able to participate in the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service Salmon in the Schools program. When, when they dropped off the egg, it was really cool because I was, I was so excited to learn about salmon and like how they get away from, from predators really easily. And so I had so many questions in mind, but then now I, my answers are already answered. You see that hatch? Yeah. That's weird, kind of. How, how big is that hut? Pretty small. That fits in this egg. And now we have 32. Oh! Can you put the eye. that one right there? Look at the eye. And do you guys see the heart? That one no, right there. The heart right there. Right there. there. The heart right there. Wait, I can't see nothing. It's right there. I need my glasses. Ew, what is that? Is that the is that what they what is that what they eat? Yeah. Yeah, the yolk. That's the yolk. Ugh. They be eating, they be eating their own inside? Well no, that's just their food. Eventually they'll oh he's moving. The eye moves. It just moved again. It's, it's like a tire, but I also got to see the fins that of the salmon in real life because when we had it on paper, it, we couldn't actually like, see the parts and the colors they are. But they told us what colors to do it. But it, the colors actually are like grayish, bluish, and they're really small. When we were learning about the salmon life cycle, we did posters on it and we listed um, the stages. It's egg and then uh, the next egg, one is alvin. Alvin and, and then fry and, and smolt and, and ocean adult, adult and spawn adult. Guys, this is really wrong. You're not really Everything's going Look, wrong. everything's going in that little pipe now. Literally everything. Flesh program was really helpful. It helped us understand that some of the stuff that we throw outside is affecting the salmon because it goes into the water. When we went on our field trip and when we were on the bus, it was kind of like the fashion of fish, the fashion of salmon. <laughs> we uh we did the same, like the same thing, but it was like a quiz, and he was like, Mr. Jeff was quizzing the adults. But since we learned so much about the salmon, he let us answer some of the questions. The most interesting part for me was how we got to see the inside, like what do salmon do, the lateral line that, that they have to feel how the currents change and, and um, how, and how, um, we get to see the heart and the insides of the salmon. My favorite part was the dissection because um, we, I, I got to learn more about like how their swim bladder works and I saw the uh, teeth on their tongue. We took my, Microsoft close-ups with the, uh, the salmon. We did the gills, the heart, and the eyes, and the teeth because the salmon have they are cheap because they're sharp to take off the prey. It's March 10th. We're ready to take our salmon home. Yeah. Columbia. The Columbia? Ding, ding, ding. Give that young woman a prize. That is the Columbia River. Let me tell you guys about the field trip that we've been to. Um, it was a really long ride, but then when we got there, we, we went to a trailer and it had like different machines in it and when they get the salmon they put, it goes from small 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 salmon to the big ones
we saw the salmon ladders where uh, there's these kind of metal walls um, that fill up with water and so the adult salmon when they come back they climb up the ladders. I liked it when we got to feed the fish because when we were feeding them they all started like to jump out of the water and getting it and there are really lots of them in there. A thousand pounds of feed every day. The, the, the salmon, when, when we were getting released, some, it was really sad, but it was really fun learning about the salmon, and when we got, when we were holding them in cups, they were like wiggling all around, they are like, let me go, but then some of our classmates called, named them, named them, uh, and I named them, Fred, I named him Freddy, and it was really fun. Well, I learned from the from all of the salmon month is um the about the environment how salmon live and how other animals live um how how we all get to uh see salmon and with the uh fish and wildlife uh people and shelter I am happy that we are one of the few schools that got salmon. I am thankful for what they did for us.